Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to show you how to calculate the CCC or the cash conversion cycle from financial statements. Let's take this example. Determine the cash conversion cycle of firm Z that has the following data. Inventory $140 million, cost of goods sold annual $1,013.9 million, accounts receivables $445 million, accounts payables $115 million, and annual sales $1,216.7 million. So how could we calculate the cash conversion cycle of firm Z using these data? So we know that the formula of the cash conversion cycle is inventory conversion period plus average collection period minus the payable deferral period. To determine the inventory conversion period, we should use this formula. Inventory over cost of goods sold per day. The inventory amount is given in the exercise $140 million. However, the cost of goods sold per day is not given. What is given is the annual cost of goods sold. So we need to determine the cost of goods sold per day. All what we have to do is to divide the annual amount by 365 days. So the cost of goods sold per day is $2.777 million. Also, to determine the average collection period, we need to divide the receivables or the accounts receivables, which is 445 million over the sales per day. However, we are given the annual sales, so we need to determine uh, the sales per day, we shall divide the annual sales by 355, uh, 365 uh, days. As a result, the sales per day will be $3.333 million. So, in this case, the inventory conversion period will be 140 million over the 2.777 cost of goods sold per day. So, it is equal to 50. 0.4 days. So this is the inventory conversion period. So the company Z needs 50.4 days to convert the raw material into finished goods and sell them. Regarding the average collection period, it is the amount of uh, accounts receivables, 445, divided by the sales per day, 3.333. So it is equal to 133.5 uh, days so the company needs uh, or gives its customers 133.5 days to pay for their purchases and finally the payable deferral period which is the payables over the cost of goods sold per day so the amount of accounts payable 115 over the 2.777 it's equal to 41.4 days so the company needs 41.4 days to pay for its suppliers as a result the ccc is equal to 50.4 plus uh, 133.5 minus the 41.4 days the ccc is equal to 142.5 days